introduce the extremely, exceptionally talented Melissa Etheridge. No stage rushing. Hi. Oh. Oh. We'll make him sit down after all. Hey, how you doing? Now, if you'd have told me, I was laying there on my bed having chemotherapy, that I'd be on a pink plane flying with a lot of pink people. Yeah. I don't know. I, I, might, I, I might not have believed you, but this is a. Uh, we've come a long way in five years, I gotta say. And uh, this is pretty fun. I've never done this before. I think it. I think I've joined some kind of Mile High Club. We all have. I, I'm not sure. What it is. <laughs> Yeah, something like that. So let's, uh, you know, just, I, I love you all. Fans, I love you. Breast cancer survivors, you know I love you. You know it's a sisterhood and we're there. And you always come up to me wherever I am. Wherever I am in the whole wide world, there's always someone who's been touched by this. And they're always coming up. They're always saying things. They're saying thank you. And, and I got to tell you, thank you. You guys have you've made this journey pretty amazing one so far. Well, there's a lot to do, so all right. Yeah, everybody thanks Hard Rock and all those people, and I, I love them and I thank them too. Oh. Huh. How many times have I sung this song today? <laughs> but it's today is the day, very pink day, and I wrote this song uh, about four and a half years ago. And I wrote it about, I wanted to write it about surviving, because I knew I knew I was going to survive, and I knew that survival is a state of mind, health is a state of mind, and that's the one thing people always ask me, Melissa, what would you say to someone if they asked you, if, if they were going through this, what would you say? I would say, you are more powerful than you know. You are, you, you are in charge of your health. You are in charge of your life. This is your life. Now's the time to make your choices, what you need to do. Start thinking, as women, sometimes... We, we like to think about everybody else, and then we're we're tenth or eleventh on the list. No, you got you guys. You, we got to be number one. Start thinking about that. And health is absolutely the most important thing. And I know you know that. All right. All right. It's been years since they told her about it. The darkness her body possessed, and the scars are still there in the mirror. Every day, she gets herself dressed. Although the pain is miles and miles behind her, and the fear is now a dust beast. If you ask her why she is still running, she tells you it makes her complete. Cause I run for They told me about it. Now the darkness had taken its toll. And they cut into my skin. And they cut into my body. But they will never get a piece of my soul. And now I am still learning the lesson to awake when I hear the call. And if you ask me,
Champion d'Or.